Hi, I wanted to come to you today and put together a video um, to explain to all of you why I do incentive programs. I'm actually going to do it two parts. I'm going to do the first one, why I do incentive programs in my piano studio, and then the second one I am going to introduce to you as parents the um, incentive program that I put together for this year so you have a better understanding. I realized that um, when I first started doing incentive programs, a lot of times parents were waiting because we were way out in the country. And now a lot of times you're dropping off your kids, so maybe you don't get to see in studio as much about what the program's about. So anyway, I just wanted to put together some informational videos for you so you understand what's going on. And hopefully it will help you um, be more supportive to me. And also it will help your kids grow and learn a lot better and quicker. So... The reason, um, a couple of years ago I did start, this will be my third year of doing a main incentive program for the entire year. I do little incentive programs for over the summer because I want to excite your kids and have a little fun in the summer. They're a little more loose in the summer, like how, you know, trying to get as many pieces as possible. Um, or we just kind of work on one goal at a time. So I guess this last summer we didn't really do that too much because we were working on um, on composing. So anyway, so as we get started here for the fall, I just wanted to come to you and show you or tell you why I do it. Um, the first reason why I do um, uh, the incentive programs is because it's fun. Um, I want to create a fun atmosphere here in the piano studio. I want your kids to look forward to it. If they're having fun and I'm having fun, then um, it's just a whole lot better for everybody all around. Um, and if your kids are having fun, they're going to want to practice. They're going to want to try to reach the goals, which, by the way, I put all the goals out to be um, specific for um, achieving piano skills and performance and all kinds of things. So, and I try to put a wide variety so that it's not just like um, the kids who play really well get all the rewards. It should all be rewards that all the kids can do. Um, so anyway, I always think it's fun to do kind of a theme and then follow along that theme and we can um, add to that and, you know, really come along with the um, incentives. Okay, so that kind of leads to the second reason why I do incentive programs here in um, Prairie Scraps Music Studio. And the reason that is, is the second reason is that I want your kids to reach goals. I want them to be attainable. I want it to be measurable. I want them to be able to come in and be like, oh yeah, I have achieved 40 pieces or uh, this year. Um, your kids should be able to measure that they did so many X amount of theory pages or they have an understanding of what notes are which notes on the staff. So that's why I do the one minute club. So um, anyway, that's kind of the second reason is that I really sit down and go, okay, where do you your kids need to grow? Where do they need to learn? What have they missed so far? Or what have they, what do they need to get better at? And so that's why I sit down and it may seem a little complicated at first, my incentive programs, but I do try to cover a lot of different areas like, um, being able to perform pieces, lots of pieces. I don't want your kids to just work on five pieces all year long and never pass another piece. I want them to be able to go through repertoire. I want them to be able to know um, their theory. I want them to know their notes. If you said, what is this note on this the staff? Then I want your kids to be able to know that. That's what I'm here for. That's what we're trying to learn and teach here. Um, and then there's just a lot of, oh, composers. I want your kids to get out to performances. I think it's very important to watch other people perform and see how they go through the process of performing. Um, so those are kind of the reasons why, um, I think it's important to have those goals. And so I build those into the incentive programs for a reason, because I want to make sure that we're achieving those. And the third one is, and this one you might not totally understand or like, it does seem a little bit like um, I am maybe buying, you know, re or rewarding um, for, um, for behaviors. But at the end of the day, you know what? I'm a gift person. I love to get gifts. I love to give gifts. And so most kids really do enjoy 
picking from the prize basket or doing a long-term goal. So I do try to um, have some of it be long-term and short-term goals, but um, and and I try not to make it super easy for them to earn rewards, but yet I want the rewards kind of dangling out there um, for them because I think it's fun. And um, like I said, who doesn't like getting a gift? If you ask most of your kids um, if they like Christmas gifts or if they like birthday gifts, they're probably going to say yes, they love getting a gift. So that's why I have built in the rewards because I want your kids, um, some of the rewards this year are going to be um, not necessarily like prize as much, um, I try as much as possible to stay away from the candy rewards. I like to throw them in a little bit because I like candy myself and, um, you know, let's face it, candy's good. Um, but anyway, I want it to be something that your kids love. Um, I can say that some, I've had parents say that they, their, their kid isn't prize motivated. And I could tell you that I can't think of a single kid that has come in, even the ones who've said that doesn't motivate my child, um, actually, did come in and check the prize basket every single week. So um, almost every single kid wants to see what's in there. I try to put new things in all the time, keep it fresh. Um, and then the other thing too is that when kids see the other kids in the studio getting so far, like on the karate belts last year, they were able to see like, oh, is so-and-so on the what belt are they on? So it also creates a reward system without actually giving them a gift. It creates um, camaraderie and um, a little bit of competition is goes a long way. So as you guys know. Um, so anyway, that's why I like to do the incentive programs. I don't do it because I want to make it more complicated for you as parents. Honestly, I'm trying to make it easier because one, it's fun and then your kids want to do it on their own. Um, and two, because it's getting through some of the goals that we have trying to learn piano. And three, um, because those rewards are fun and kids will usually work for short time and long term rewards. So with that being said, that is why in Prairie Scraps Music Studio, I do put in the incentive programs. Um, and I just wanted you guys to all understand that and know that for the future. So there you go. Uh, look for that second video.